And here's the headlines in cheap news. Floods in Victoria continue to wreak havoc, with some houses becoming submerged. More in natural disasters, Queensland is suffering at the hands of a major drought, just as bushfires on the Eyre Peninsula in South Australia continue to rage and destroy houses. Not that house, I just burnt that one for footage. Ongoing domestic violence against children continues to be a problem in the northern suburbs of Adelaide. Minister for Health Janine Hill said, The government's plans to introduce more protection for domestic violence victims is temporary relief and won't stop the problem. We don't have the footage, but she, she fucking said that. Alright. And now in entertainment, the Oscar nominations are in and Leo DiCaprio has got the nod for his exhilarating performance in The Wolf of Wall Street. We have an exclusive clip for you right now. Look at all my cash. I won it on Wall Street. Uh, it's, it's like your TAB, I guess. And once more, detainees in Papua New Guinea have broken out in violence. But luckily, Australian immigration authorities were there to settle the peace. And in more news, MP Craig Thompson has been found guilty for using government cards to pay for sex. Oi! Get the fuck out of here, mate! That's not him. And in sport, the Australian Test team continues to dominate this summer with a crushing win over South Africa. Mitchell Johnson took a bag of wickets. Yes! Fuck off, cunt! And now for the weather. It's going to be raining here, um, wherever this is. So if you think you might live here, uh, bring an umbrella. And this just in, a third female body has been found in the Frankston area just this morning. Is this string of crimes related? It's bloody likely. And in world news, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un remains adamant their country's not stockpiling nuclear weapons. And in finance, the government are unsure whether or not to offer Qantas a financial bailout. And later tonight, does rolling in packets of chips ease back pain? Our studies were inconclusive and a waste of time, and you don't want to miss it. And that's the cheap news. We'll finish with a feel-good story. A cat laid on a purple rug today. There you go, have a look at that. <laughs> Cats are fucked, aren't they?